Hi, Joe Burnage with Big West Marketing and CarpetCleaningWebsites.net. In this short video, I want to go over a case study of a website that we just redesigned using uh, the cheat sheet. If you haven't seen the cheat sheet video or if you don't have a copy of this cheat sheet, I will put a link on this video or below this video so that you can link over there and grab a copy of this, print it out, and see exactly what I'm talking about. But let's jump right in and see what we did to improve this website. So, UJ Brothers is the, uh, here's their old website or their current website that we are getting ready to replace. And going down the worksheet here, or the cheat sheet, I want to uh, talk about just a few things we did um, as far as usability goes. So making it easy for somebody to get on and use the site. Uh, first thing we did is uh, we improved the logo, to make it a little more clearer and make sure it's on every page. On the old site here, you see the logo down here, just a tiny little logo and it's only on the home page. What we did is we, on the new site, we put it up here in the header so it shows up on every page. We made it nice and big and bold. And then since they had a sun in their logo, we made a little sky background there. So we just made that improvement there, a little more um, pleasing to the eye, made a little bit more sense, and it's great for branding. Um, we also added this, uh, this little, um, slogan here or a little, expl uh, little explanation of what the business is all about. So professional, residential, commercial, and janitorial services. Uh, just to give people a little bit better idea when they land on the website, what exactly UJ Brothers does and make sure that they will fit their needs. Okay. Uh, another thing we did, if you go back to the old website, is you do not see a big bold phone number anywhere uh, when you first get on the site. You actually have to scroll down to find it there and it's not on every page so what we did is we made sure it was that was also in the header with a call to action for a free estimate call that's the call to action or one of the calls to action and uh, and then made sure that that phone number is easy to read and is on every page at the very top so you don't have to scroll down to find it that's a huge improvement there that can easily double triple response uh, you know a response from a website if somebody lands on the, the home page there so the next thing we did is we changed the navigation. Now, um, if you're looking down the cheat sheet here, you'll see that uh, it talks about how you need to have a horizontal navigation and make sure it's very easy to read. On the old website here, they have a vertical, and the, the text is tiny. It's hard to even read. If anybody has any, um, if they're visually impaired in any way, they're not going to be able to even see these here. So, um, and also, people have been trained to uh, when they're looking to navigate around a website to look for a horizontal menu. So we went ahead and made that improvement there uh, much easier to use that way. Um, we also added this contact form in case people can't call or don't want to call uh, late at night or if they're at their office and they're not allowed to make calls they can just use this form in st instead. That was, And that's on every page of the, of the new site here. On the old website um, they did have it on the uh, contact us page um, but like I said, it's hard to even read the Contact Us page. Um, you want to give that option to people on every single page and uh, make sure they don't have to scroll, click, anything like that to find it. So as far as usability, that's where it goes. Now, um, let's talk about uh, trust elements. What do we do as far as creating more trust when people land on the website? Well, they have this, uh, this video that they got from Truck Mount Forum, which is a really good video. It's not personal, like it's not personal with the UJ brothers on there, um, but the video itself comes off as being very personal. I like this video, and so um, that is going to instill trust, seeing that they actually have something that um, kind of talks and makes a connection with the person that gets that lands on the website. Um, on the old website, if you scroll down, they did have a generic Rotovac video, but that doesn't really make a good connection with people. It might help if people are wondering what the process is. But that is uh, not even close to being as important as making this connection like they did with this personal video here. So we got that taken care of. Um, we also added testimonials here. So if you click on the testimonials page, they have a list of testimonials. We're going to be adding to that as more testimonials come in. Um, we've got some uh, trust icons down along the right-hand side here for Google, Yelp, Facebook, YouTube. Just kind of instills trust, showing, hey, you know, we're uh, we do, um, we're we're in multiple places on the internet. Just having these on here, even if people aren't going to click on them and use them, will instill trust. So, 
Um, and then another thing we have as far as a call to action, and this is optional depending on how you uh, how your business model is, is they've got this uh, click here for $99 specials, a nice big orange button. Their eye is definitely going to be drawn to this, and like I said, it's on every page. So when they click on that, it takes them over to a specials page. And a lot of people don't want to do coupons. They don't want to do specials. That's fine. This, Like I said, this is optional, um, but it definitely will increase phone calls. Um, and if you know how to upsell once you get into the home or upsell once you're on the phone with package options, which I've talked about before, then you can turn a $99 job easily into a $200 or $300 job. Um, I've tried this little menu option here before like this. Um, for my carpet cleaning business, it works great if, like I said, if you can upsell. Um, the big thing is you just want to give people options and let them know that there, you know, you could, there's lots of different things, lots of different things you offer. So you know they've got different combinations of rooms and upholstery and this and that, all fitting into this $99 special. So uh, that's a great call to action that can be changed however you want. I'm not saying to use the $99 special menu, but if your business model allows for it, then it's a great option. Okay, another thing we did as far as uh, SEO is concerned is if you look at the, uh, the title tag, if you hover over the little tab at the top here, that title tag is very untargeted. Uh, it says carpet cleaning and janitorial services in Mount Vernon, WA, zip code, and then it says Burlington, LaConnor, Washington. So it's got three different cities and there are three different zip codes. It's way too long and uh, Google could consider that uh, keyword stuffing. So if you look at our new one, what we did, if you hover over the new one, is we made it nice, short, and sweet. Um, we focused on one city and if you want to focus on multiple cities, you can have different pages for that. But in this case, we just want to focus on Mount Vernon where they're located, their main city. Um, they have their business name and then their phone number in there. Short, sweet, uh, the home page, that's definitely you want to have that nice, short, sweet, and more targeted. So we improved the SEO, the on-site SEO, as far as the keywords are concerned. Um, we made sure that uh, so, so we made sure that there was unique content on the new site. So let's let's take uh, if we take all this content here and we copy that and we put it in a copyscape, which is what we use to determine if it's going to be, uh, you know. Uh, duplicate content to avoid Google's duplicate content penalties. Um, you know, if you've got an account with Copyscape, you paste this information in here, this text. Let's do a search on that. So there are um, 45 different websites that have uh, some of that content, if not a big chunk of it. Um, so what we did is we had that a lot of that rewritten so that it would pass copyscape, which is very important for SEO reasons. So uh, we got that taken care of. Um, another thing here is if you look at the uh, the old website, now if you shrink your website down to a cell phone size, you can see it is not responsive, it is not mobile friendly. It is huge these days to have a mobile friendly site if you don't know that. Um, I'm telling you that you do for, for both user and for Google rankings. Um, Google will penalize you if you don't have a mobile site or responsive site set up. Here's what happens when we shrink down on the new site to mobile size. It lines everything up and it also pops in this little graphic here with a, a phone number button that somebody can just tap to call. So if this was a phone and you tap that, it would start calling. Uh, instead, it launches this little application on my desktop computer here. But um, then when we go back out, it pops in the normal header and now we're completely mobile friendly. We have run it through the Google mobile testing tool and it does pass. So that's huge. Um, another thing we did here, which is very important for SEO, if you look on the old site, they listed all their services on one page. Okay, And what you need to do for SEO reasons and for usability reasons is to make sure that each service has its own page. So if you go hover over the services menu item here on the nav bar, It'll drop down and we'll have a separate page for each and every service that UJ Brothers offers. That is huge for SEO. That is huge for usability. Um, so that's another big improvement we made. Um, and as far as uh, all the other cities that they service, we went ahead and put that into the footer so that all these cities and zip codes show up on every single page. Anytime you go to a new page, um, Google can see 
that it applies to more than just one city. That can help with some organic ranking, um, especially if you're doing like a, a power, you know, sending power links and doing an SEO program um, for a website, like a monthly uh, full-blown SEO program. So that's all the improvements we made. Like I said, it's all here on this one page website cheat sheet. Uh, if you have not, if you don't have a copy of this, click on the link below. Um, watch the video that goes along with it because it'll explain in detail everything that, it, that um, this sheet talks about. So thank you guys for watching this. This is just a case study before and after video. I wanted to uh, show you guys. If you have any questions, give us a call. 406-493-1881. Or hop on our website, carpetcleaningwebsites.net, and you can set up a consultation, and we'll talk to you soon. Thanks.